Mish has COVID. So, uh, good morning from <coughs> from a mom who is not prepared. I might just have to take y'all through the day with me. Hi, you guys. My name is Ashley Latisse, and yep, we just woke up to a chaotic morning. As I mentioned, my fiance is sick with COVID as of maybe 8:30 this morning. So. Now I'll be navigating the entire day with the three kids on my own. <laughs> so the girls were already up. They're downstairs, finished up breakfast, and they're just hanging out. Cairo woke up a little bit later. He actually soiled his entire little onesie. So I'm in the nursery changing his clothes. And then we are going to head downstairs so I can clean up and just start to Clorox every. I'm about to wash the breakfast dishes. It's still the nine o'clock hour, and then I'm gonna pour us some freshly grated ginger tea. It helps with inflammation when you're feeling sick, sore throat. Misha actually put me onto this years ago. So I'm pouring us both a cup. You can add honey if you like, lemon. And I mean, ironically, he went to Costco last week and bought this five pack of like Clorox wipes. So have them in every room I'm going to be Cloroxing everything I mean what perfect timing the phones the knobs the handles your remote controls everything I'm wiping down because I'm trying to avoid the whole house getting sick and this is my beautiful breakfast the kids leftovers I'm gonna nurse Cairo I forgot all the burp cloths upstairs because I've been washing everything I'm gonna eat while nursing him try to drink 24 ounces for my skin's sake as it's like a lot better. And we're just gonna, um, I really cannot plan a day like this, so I don't know what's gonna happen. Maybe we should get you some gloves, babe. Let me walk around. So we're finishing up breakfast and I'm thinking that I'm going to take all the kids on a walk but first we need to go upstairs, brush teeth, brush hair and get everybody dressed. Easy. What happened? What happened? Oh no. Oh no. Girl. Yeah. So right now it is, um, what time is it? It's like, we came upstairs at 10.33, so it's almost 11. And nursing Kai Kai. We're gonna go on a walk. It's only about 80 degrees outside. He's looking your nose. We're just gonna go outside for a walk. I'm gonna order them lunch, probably McDonald's on DoorDash. I look like I'm sweating. Um, it is about to be 11, so I wasn't too far off. Can you even see that? It's about to be 11, and I'm gonna take them on a walk. I'm about to get dressed and just throw on anything. I feel like they're all wild and crazy. Maybe they just, they needed they should have been out of the house to be honest. Usually, if I take them somewhere, it's like 10. We're gonna go on a walk order them some lunch i'm gonna clean during that time and then we're gonna just see how the day goes but yeah i think they just need to get outside oh goodness okay let's go let me i typically get sparrow dressed last and that's because she helps me so much with the babies sparrow's my oldest my six-year-old so we're in her room and her hair needs to be completely redone but for today's sake i'm just gonna brush it back slick it down i use a mousse only when i'm styling her hair in these twists she's had them in for two weeks since school started so it's just about time to take them out but she's a trooper 
Um, I just brush them back. Cairo usually hangs out. Zahara is somewhere running around. And this is how we get it done. If you'd only open up your eyes, see me. I've been waiting there forever, can't you tell? Even love your darkest sides, but you don't need me. You don't need me, only see me as a friend. I could get used to the magic of your life. I'm gonna spray their hands with doTERRA on guard it's a hand sanitizer and they're having McDonald's for lunch once they're done I'm just gonna drink a smoothie I wasn't really feeling McDonald's today um, I just want to have like a lot of energy and be as healthy as I can so I'm gonna make a smoothie oh here came our target groceries since I'm not going to the store since I don't know if we have COVID too um, I did get a delivery placed earlier I'm gonna just put away all the perishable items and the rest I'll save for later probably sometime after their nap to enter my favorite part of the day <laughs> it is nap time so we go to the baby's room Cairo side is not even finished but it is it will be a tandem nursery and Zahara somehow you know wet her whole entire outfit so I changed her clothes gave her her bottle and then I'm gonna change Kai's diaper so that way when I get him in the room it'll take less than 10 minutes to put him to sleep lights out for both the babies while Sparrow is on her iPad chilling and then we're gonna play Kai woke up, so I came back down and finished it. I'm watching Arnell Armand on YouTube. I'm gonna finish my second glass, 24 ounces. So I do about four of these a day. And it is now 145, 147. I have a couple options. I need to either start cooking. I know it sounds crazy because we eat closer to six, but I either need to start getting it ready since I won't have Misha's help at all. Um, that's one thing. I need to have Sparrow work in her workbook for 15 to 20 minutes. That like is also a thing. I need to record the voiceover for my next upload on YouTube. And then there's one more thing. I know I had some other, like I had one more thing that I need to clean and Lysol everything. So that's honestly the priority. That's gonna come first. I'm gonna do that right now and just at least the downstairs area. So that's first. So I actually took off before this all the couch covers, everything. I vacuumed under the couch, sprayed under there, and now I'm vacuuming on top of the couch. Spraying there, I took off all the throw pillows, Lysol those, and once he's past COVID, or once if it hits all of us, once we're past it, I'm gonna wash all of the couch covers. Thankfully, they're machine washable. Um, I decided to hit the laundry, just taking out the blankets that he was sleeping with. I washed those, all the clothes, washed those, like just busy, 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 go, go, go. And then, no sooner than later, Kai woke up. Surprise, surprise. Cairo is up. Woke up at 3. I put them both down. I want to see 1 ish, 1 30. In between that time, we woke up twice. So I guess he's eating, but I'm already pretty much done with cooking dinner. I'm going to let the spaghetti cook for another 30 minutes. So everything's pretty much ready. I have to strain the broccoli. I don't think I'll be making Texas toast, but we'll see if I have time because now he wants to nurse. He's been here for about half an hour. And yeah, but I pretty much got it done. The days, I mean, it's not so bad considering I'm uh, doing this by myself today. I tried out a new baby food and Kai loved it. I don't know how to pronounce it, but here you go. It's from Target. Um, the kids had spaghetti, broccoli, and fruit. I let them, we went on another walk actually after they were done. They played for a bit and then it was bath time. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm giving Kai a bath first. 
I use Cetaphil Baby uh, bath wash and lotion. I use the whole line basically. It's my favorite. I love the scent. Um, it's also gentle on his skin. I'm going to wash his hair tonight. I'm just washing everybody, everything, except for the girl's hair actually. That would take way too long. But I'm going to wash his hair and everything just to be like extra careful. Um, this is what I use to comb out the little hair that he has left because most of it's already falling out. But on the top, his little curls, comb it out. And then I'll take him to the room, lotion him, massage his legs, his feet, get him ready for bed, and then the girls will be soon after. Once I got the babies down, I completely forgot that I had promised Bear I would make her cookies. So I'm making her four cookies before she's gonna go to bed. That was her dessert. And then I'm gonna put all the food away. Normally Mish would do this part of the kitchen while I'm like doing stuff for the kids or laundry or something. So now I'm doing all of the things. I put the food away, I'm cleaning up the kitchen. Again, using all the Clorox wipes to wipe down everything. Lysoling everything again for, I don't know how many times I've done that today. Finishing my final cup of water, 24 ounces. I was just pouring it into ice because sometimes I like it to be ice cold. And then I'm gonna, you guys, it's already, it's late. I'm gonna go get myself ready for bed. One a.m. I am going to rush this washing my face, brushing my teeth, flossing, rinsing everything, getting my clear correct in, and I'm going to pass out. This was the longest day ever, but somehow, if you're watching this to the end, somehow we were able to avoid the kids getting sick and myself. So all this cleaning, every single second of every moment. 100% worked as always if you're new here or if you're back don't forget to like this video and subscribe and I'll see you guys next week for another day in the life